G'day all, welcome back again to Dad vs. Son and our playthrough of Battle Hymn from Victory Games. And we are still in rounds uh, due to the fact that we still have active Japanese on the map. We have the uh, Chief of Air Ops over here with a idling Zero Fighter and... Why? Uh, we've got uh, an officer and the uh, chief engineer here, and we have a light tank here, and all of them have two activations and will be going first. So again, with them, the first thing that happens is we go in alphabetical order, and the Japanese action number is seven, so it will be M first okay now um is there anything i need to know about this hairy plane japanese zero wildcat taxi speed is eight righto uh so m it is and he's using special condition t for seven and t is all the same nine seven three right oh so nine seven three and i think he's going to just taxi and run away uh nine seven three okay start fighter one action that's already happened if fighter engine already running, taxi into 05 first. Okay, so this is one to there. Okay, let's just go and do a one. I want to keep uh, count on his uh, moves. He's got eight. Uh, 05 says go to N4. Uh, that's two. And from N4, we go to M4. That's three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, he's not going to get off. Okay, so that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Well, we'll just keep on going. Okay, M, N4 goes to M4. M4 to L3, L3 to K3, K3 to J2, J2 to I2, I2 to H1, One, two, I'm oh, sorry, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep, we're still going. Uh, I won. H, no, H1, idiot ass. To G1. So we started in 04, uh, 04. one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, we stopped there. That was the eighth. Okay, that's as far as he goes. He is done. That is M. Next one is N. The Chief of Engineers. We are in condition four and we are doing number seven, which is nine, two, three. He's, oh, hang on. N is doing special P now, which is going to be 800. So much to keep track of. 800. Lie prone. Okay. So N lies prone. Uh, 
Then we go to X, who's not doing anything special. Condition 2 to 4 for a 7 is 8, 6, 5. Uh, if no active target is in sight, move as quickly as possible. Fall prone if an active target is in sight. Okay, so this is X. Move as quickly as possible. So he is there. So he's going to be standing. There is a doorway or a window. There's a window right there. He is in S7. And he has four movement points. S7. Go S6. So that's going to be 1, 2. Uh, S6. Go to S5. That is 3. And S5 says 304. 304. If soldier is moving, enter S4. Well, that's what he does. So that's 234. That's as far as he can go. Okay. So that's done. So now we're up to Y, the light tank. Um, enters open, cannon prepared, when open, two crew exposed. And we have a 7, which is 907. What is it going to do? I've never... I don't think I've played with vehicles in a long, long time, so I hope I don't screw this up too much. Okay, if three or more active targets in sight, well, there's nobody in sight. If one or two active targets in sight, no. If no active targets in sight, open. We're already open. If already open, C913. If vehicle has been fired on, drive fast. Well, nobody's fired on it. If vehicle is not being fired on, drive slowly. Okay, so a tank, 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 slow movement point allowance is four. Righto. So he is in Y5. Uh, so Y5 is to X5. Makes sense. Uh, still can't see anybody, can't do anything. We go to X5, which goes to W6. That's 1, 2. Uh, W6, we go to V6. Makes sense. And V6, we go to U7. And there we are. We are moving slow. And because we're moving slow, we don't have to do anything else. Um, that's it, I believe. Um, nothing to see, nothing to do. So X is done and Y is done and we have Adams. So we need to get Adams out of there. Um, Adams is going to move to P12. Okay, P12 is an event, bugger. And we get six. Random event six is 494. What poo do they have for us? If S6 has not occurred, S6 has. If F6... Bleh. If sighting six has occurred, five zero six. Five zero six. If Japanese seventeen is active, he is. No event. Okay, no event. That's it. Um, so then we're back to M again.
Right, we need a new number, and we get a 2 this time. Uh, M is using special condition T, and they're all the same, 973, which is taxi on. So he is in H1. It says go to G1, and G1 says exit, and he flies away. Okay, zero is gone. He is gone. I'm not going to put him in act inactive because he's not inactive, just in case he flies back home. So that's that. Uh, but I'll just put him up the back there, out of the way. Righto, N. N is in here. Uh, not. He's using condition P. And we have a 2, which is 865. 865. Okay, if no active target is in sight, move as quickly as possible. Fall prone if an active target is in sight. Okay, no, there's nobody. So he's going to stand up. That's his free stance change. Uh, N has a movement of four. So he is in S7. He's going to go the same way as the other bloke. Uh, go to S6, so that's going to be 1, 2, because he's going through an aperture. Uh, S6, go to S5, Boop. there he goes. And that's 3, and S5, 304, if moving like the other guy, Boop. up into there. Like that, which was S4. Righto. So that is N done. Now we have X. And X is not doing anything special. We have condition 4 with the 2 is 808. Uh, if no active target in sight, crouch. Okay, at least it's going to crouch there. Boop. Which leaves Y. Why is it so? Right ho. So again, we have a two this time, um, which means a nine hundred. Nine hundred. Drive slowly. Fire cannon if active target in building hex or an active US vehicle is in sight. Prepare cannon if unable to fire. Well, it's already prepared, so there's no need for that. If cannon prepared and no cannon target is in sight, conduct snap fire with coax machine gun at second closest target and conduct snap fire with bow machine gun at closest target. Okay, so we're going to drive slowly. Um, driving costs them, um, uh, driving slowly costs them two actions. So that leaves them the other two actions, because there's four of them in there, to fire the two machine guns. So we're going to drive slowly. That's four um, movement points again. So we're in U7. We go to T7 for one. T7 to S8 for 2, S8 to R8 for 3, still nothing there, uh, and R8 to, we are in R8, yep, 057, okay, 057. If soldier is moving... No. If vehicle is moving and there is an active US soldier east of this hex, this is east, remember? Then go to Q8. Otherwise, enter Q9. So we come into here. One, two, three, four. But can't see through the blocking terrain here. 
so that's fine um, he can turn around that way now that's fine or like that and he is done and now it is up to us I don't think we want to be there for him so um, Adams is simply going to go prone And that is him done. Green is going to move in there with him and go prone. So he is done. Um, who else have I got here? Baker is going to go prone. So that one can stay there like that. Baker is going to go to prone. That is him done. Collins is going to go forward to Baker and go prone. Holt is going to do the same and go prone, which leaves Douglas, who is here, who is not going to do anything, and Fredericks, who is here, who is going to go into 013 and go uh, hang on. He's stepping. He's got a step to do this, like the others did. He's going to step into 013. We check the Duva because we haven't been there before. 013 is none. And then he goes prone as well. And now everybody is out of sight, out of mind. So that is done, and he's panicked, so he's got nothing to do, and we have finished that round. Okay, so we have a random event, uh, number five, for the next round. Random event five is 494, which we've had, I believe... 494, if S6 has not occurred, yes, it has. If it has occurred, 506. If Japanese 17 is active, no event. No. That was uh, M. If Japanese 17 has already exited the map from G1, see 542. So 542, go to condition 5. Okay, we are now at condition five. So I can get rid of that card. And we can go to condition five. And we'll need to do all our checks. Uh, we don't have any event markers on the board, so we can ignore that. Uh, lowest number first. So this is a 12, 13, 13. So we're going to do here first. So P12. P12 is 398. 398. If S0 has not occurred or J13 has been removed by evasive movement, C405. Uh, J13... No, he wasn't removed by evasive movement. It has occurred. So otherwise, no event. So no event for there. Uh, so then we're into the 13. So we do N first. N13 is none. Then we do O13, which is none. Uh, and then both of these are 16, so it's 016, which is an event, which we ignore, and Q16, which is an event, which we ignore. Okay, so that's where we are. We roll for advantage, and it's Japanese advantage, and they have a 6 which gives the tanky one go, and it gives uh, N and X two goes, two turns, and we have a five. 
So Adams gets one with a, um, oh, sorry, two with a panic check. He's there, he's fine. Uh, Baker and Connor, uh, Collins with a five get one go, so so does Douglas. Um, Edmonds, Fredericks and Green on a five. Now, that's Douglas, this is Edmonds. So Edmonds is only going to get one. Fredericks and Green are going to get two. And Holt is going to get one with a panic check. Holt is here. He is a one. And uh, he's with Collins, which gives him a two. He's with Baker for another three is five. So he's fine. And he's only two away from there. So all good. And the action number for the Japanese will be five. And I think we will call it quits there. Um, so we're now into condition five. We need still five VP um, and to escape off the western board edge by raft again. Um, but that's about it. So take care and bye for now.